Deep learning is a hot topic today. It has achieved tremendous success in many domains, including computer vision, natural language processing, and healthcare. However, their predictions are not trustworthy. Here is an illustration. We train the ResLit on MNIST, but at test time, we input data that come from out of distributions. As you can see, the model still provides high competencies for such out of distribution data. This shows that deep neural networks are overconfident in their predictions, which is very dangerous for many safety critical applications. Therefore, it's an urgent need to equip deep neural networks with reliable uncertainty estimates. In our project, to better quantify uncertainties for deep neural networks, we propose a new method based on neural stochastic differential equation, and we name it as inlet. As we all know, ResLit is the discretized form of ordinary differential equation. However, ordinary differential equation is deterministic and can't represent uncertainty. We choose to add a Brownian motion term to make it become a stochastic differential equation. In our SDNet model, we choose to use two separate deep neural networks to represent the drift and the diffusion of the system. The drift net F aims to control the system to achieve good predictive accuracy, while the diffusion net G represents the uncertainty of the system. The diffusion is small for regions in the training distribution and high for regions outside the training distribution. Using the proposed SDN net, we conduct the experiments as we introduced before again. As we can see, SDN net can successfully provide higher uncertainties for out of distribution data. Our proposed SDN net has several benefits. It is able to model both aleatoric uncertainty, which is natural randomness inherent in the task, and epistemic uncertainty, which is ignorance about the model caused by lack of observation data. It is efficient and straightforward to implement. It is quite general and it can be applicable to both classification and regression tasks. It can achieve strong performance on four tasks including auto-distribution detection, misclassification detection, adversarial sample detection, and active learning. It is very promising for many safety critical applications, including automatic diagnosis and self-driving cars. If you are interested in our SDNet, don't forget to check our ICML paper.